A warm welcome to everyone watching the Big One Polkadot series. Those who know even a little about the Polkadot network have probably heard of the Polkadot Paracane slot auction. However, most people are unaware of Polkadot's parallel chain card slot auction. In this video, we will discuss the Polkadot Paracane slot auction. What is Polkadot? Polkadot's goal is to connect existing public chains, alliance chains, and private chains to a blockchain system via a relay chain and paracane architecture to achieve cross-chain assets, cross-chain information, and interoperability. Polkadot's evolution. The white paper was published in October 2016. The Web3 Foundation was founded in July of 2018. Substrate made its debut in October 2018. The Kusama network went live in August 2019. Polkadot mainnet candidate chain became operational in May 2020. Polkadot converted to nominated proof of stake in June 2020. DOT was split 100 times in August 2020. And the transfer function was activated. Substrate 2 was released in September 2020. The Polkadot Paracane went live in December 2020. Polkadot's technical characteristics. Impose consensus mechanism joining Polkadot can help provide shared security to the relay chain. Without any forks. The underlying logic can be automatically upgraded. Substrate is formed with a single click. Developers can send to the chain. Nested relay chain. Which is infinitely expandable. Transparent governance model. Holders can participate in community governance. Web3 Foundation Polkadot community can support excellent projects. Polkadot's architecture. The relay chain is the core of the Polkadot network. In charge of network security, consistency, and cross-chain interoperability. Paracanes can issue their chain tokens and actively upgrade sovereign blockchains for specific use cases. Pay-as-you-go paracanes can be linked to the relay chain. Or they can continue to be linked to the relay chain by renting card slots. A transit bridge is a type of blockchain that connects Polkadot shards to external networks such as Ethereum and Bitcoin. The full node of the Paracane. It is responsible for collecting and executing the transactions of the Paracane and generating candidate blocks. Submitting the blocks and proofs to the verifier. And collecting the transaction fees. Collectors are similar to miners in the proof-of-work consensus blockchain. The validator node is the complete node of the relay chain and the relay chain will assign validators to different paracanes based on random grouping in the validator pool. The validator will accept the collector's packaged block, verify its validity before using the consensus algorithm to confirm the collector's block. What is the Polkadot Paracane? The Polkadot network system is made up of a relay chain, a parallel chain, and a transfer bridge. The relay chain serves as the brain, and each paracane serves as an organ. The transfer bridge is essentially a type of paracane, but it is also responsible for connecting other blockchains with different structures. The operation of the paracane requires a certain amount of network computing resources, so its number will be limited. Gavin Wood, the Polkadot project's founder, once stated that the number of parallel chain card slots that Polkadot's relay chain can carry is limited, with an upper limit of about 100. And each time the parallel chain card slots are only one will be released. And the next card slot will be released at a predetermined time interval. As a result, the project party must obtain the parallel chain card slot through an auction.